Today's lesson is learning how to go prone. What we're going to try to do is incorporate all the things that you may not never see when shooting prone. Really odd techniques with a rifle and also a handgun. So let's get started on how to get on the ground. A couple things we need to learn prior to going prone. Before we draw that gun, we want to make sure that the gun is pointing in that target as we're going down. Never let the gun go behind you as you're going in prone position or never point it at the ground. If you fire at the ground, you could get debris to come back up at you. That would not be a good thing. Now, let's talk about how to get down on the ground properly. Now, once we've loaded up and we're going to go down range, we want to make sure when we draw the gun out, this is the first thing we want to do. We want to take our holster side, our strong side, and our support side leg, go down and capture the ground at the same time. You notice that my support leg now is kind of squatted over there, over top of me. This allows the gun to come right down top of my face here, allow my support hand to come in and drive the gun straight to the target. The longer the sight radius we have, the more control we will have over the gun when the gun is on the ground shooting. You need to get back up, get up the same way you went down. Now we're going to show you how to get down in a 45 degree angle, what we call the bicep method. So let's gas it up here, and I'm going to show you how to go down prone. You shorten up your sight radius a little bit, but you do the same technique, but point the gun always at the target as you go down. This is a 45 version. You notice the techniques I've been using with the gun fly on the ground. The gun is much more accurate and more stable for shooting hard, accurate shots and for speed. If you take the gun off the ground, the gun is very unpredictable how it will land back on the target. In the law enforcement world, for years they've told you never to put the firearm on the ground. I'm here to tell you that 99% of all firearms do operate on the ground properly. You notice I'm pressing hard on the ground with these weapons. It even works with an M4. Speaking of the rifle, going prone will be some techniques that you need to go on the range and practice with. I'm going to show you a couple different techniques real quick, and I want you to go out there and work on going prone with your rifle. Prone shooting can be the most stable base when firing a firearm on a range. Whether you shoot a handgun, a carbine, or maybe a 50 cal. Ideally is you need to go practice these things. Tony, let's go!